What is the deal, YouTube, man? It is your boy, Hollywood Troy. I am finally back with yet another video. This is going to be another shoe video, as you guys already seen from the title. I'm finally back, man, in my hometown. Finally left New York, man. You, New York was cool. I had a blast, even though I was working. I still enjoyed being out there. It was fun. I even have a little video, man, just to show you guys uh some of the sights and stuff that I did and was able to capture and see when I was out there. Not really too much because I was constantly working. But this is going to be a shoe video, you guys, of the shoe that already dropped. I got the shoe early, but it did get delivered out of here. And I wasn't able to show you guys the shoe early before the shoe actually dropped. But here I am, man. I finally made it back. So I'm still going to show you guys the shoe. I'm going to show you guys the own foot of the shoe and everything. So... Without further ado, we are going to get started with the review and on foot of the Air Jordan 4 Women's Shimmer. Air Jordan 4 Women's Shimmers, you guys, and I'm just going to go out and say this thing right here first. Let's get this part over with. Everybody is calling these the poor man's off-whites, you guys, and to be honest, I don't really want to say that because when off-whites drop, what was it, like 190 or 200 or something like that, so it might be the poor man's off-white now because 1200 is a lot for one pair of shoes. I could do that. I could spend $1,200 on the shoe, but... Why would I spend $1,200 on that one pair when I could get four or five different shoes making at the most part? But with that being said, I did opt out for the shimmers. I mean, since I didn't get a chance to go, since I didn't get a chance to get the all whites when they drop, this is something that semi kind of filled that void of the all white fours, man. But everybody is just kind of already low balling the Air Jordan 4 shimmers. Said that it's a poor man's off white. I don't necessarily agree with it. Everybody can go spend $1,200 on a shoe, but would you feel satisfied spending that $1,200 on that shoe? Me in particular, I probably won't. So let's go ahead and get started. Jump right into the shoe, man. It is like a pristine leather. I'm gonna say leather. I don't know what the exact material, but it does feel like a smooth, smooth uh, baby oil leather up on here, man. It feels very, very smooth. I like how they did that. The shoe looks great to be honest, especially in hand. It looks a lot more better than it did in pictures, to be honest. I love it, I even love like the whole translucent, like cream, off-whitish type bottom sole that they did at the bottom, it looks great. The whole, um, I wanna say nude slash opaque color look actually came out looking good. Now, as far as me to get something to rock with this, might be a little hard, but I, I think I can pull it off, you guys. The shoe actually is a great looking shoe. I'm not too bad with my decision on actually buying the shoe. Yes, the shoe is for myself, and I will report these probably soon. I don't know when. One day, I will, but the shoe actually is a great shoe, you guys. The netting on this shoe is awesome. The netting looks came out real, real good. Uh, the only thing I do have a problem with sometimes is ordering my shoes and getting them early. Day. I, I'm gonna say, I, I'm gonna just go ahead and say it's certain like, little defects I don't like. And then it makes me upset that I uh, didn't set my waste of my money. But yeah, these shoes actually don't look that bad, man. So these shoes came out great. As we hear on the tongue, we have a metallic Jordan symbol on the tongue, which I also like. I wish they would've did that same metallic Jordan symbol uh, on the back tab, but they didn't. It's more like a OP, uh, translucent like nudish more nude color someone had the sole is how the bottom sole is as well but it all came out great you also get a second pair of laces with these as well uh i want to say lavender i have no idea what the actual name of the color is of these shoe strings i just sucks at that part now i really know what color that they're going with they come out with some weird ass color uh, violet purple backdrop uh, flower or whatever the hell. I, I don't know. Some weird colors they always name cut names they always come up with. But yes, this shoe is a great pickup, you guys, in my opinion. If you missed out, shame on you, I guess. I got it because I didn't get the off whites. Yes, everybody is. Okay, I don't want to 
put it in that poor man off-white category, but it is just semi always coming up. But that's the reason why I got the shoe. I don't want to miss out. I mean, I don't even know how well the shoe did for us, like stock X and just sales and everything like that. I mean, every shoe, especially every Jordan 4 shoe, sells out when it drop. Doesn't mean that they did that that well as far as in the eye of people. But I, I don't really know. I haven't really went to go look. So my overall opinion of the shoe, I think the shoe is a great shoe. Uh, even the shoe strings, like the insole, the insoles look more like a whitish, um, like an egg white type of color. Same thing with the shoe strings as well. I would have went more for like a brighter white, like kind of uh, the midsoles or has that brighter white on the midsoles and on the sole as well. I would also went with the brighter white as far as the insoles, like they went more like a eggshell type of color white. The shoe actually, actually is a hit, not a miss in my eyes, it's actually a hit in my eyes. So I think Jordan Brand did a great shoe, really did a great job with the shoe. Should they have came out with another set of off whites? Yes. But they opt out for the shimmers, and the shimmers is, in my opinion, is a hit. So I am glad that I actually did get my hands on the shoe, guys. Now, with that being said, as of right now, I don't have too much to say. This is going to be a short video. Like I did say, you guys, I did just recently get back. Not even too long, a couple days ago. And I just been busy since I got back. Finally. If you haven't tuned into my Twitch, I do have my Twitch in 4K now, so you might want to go check that out, man. Watch me play this in 2022 NBA 2K, because I am playing that now, and it's that I had dropped when I was away, but I am up on that. Also waiting on battle for you guys, so don't don't fail to check that out as well. I might be going to game though. I might be going on another business trip. And that is it, YouTube. This is your boy Hollywood Try. I'm about to be a fighter. Help you guys actually did enjoy that video of the Air oh yeah, Jordan 4 Women Shimmer. You guys, I enjoyed making it. Even though it was a shorter video than I usually do, you guys, I am just not getting back into the mix. And you already know I'm going to be getting more shoes for you guys, man. Longer videos. And just check your boy out, follow your boy, man. Follow all my social medias, man. Check out my Twitch, man. For we, we about to be up on that thing, you know, live. So hit me up on that. Watch me on there, man. Comment in the comment section on Twitch. Comment in my YouTube, man. Even on my Instagram, you guys. Go in there and comment. Any suggestions, anything you guys want to say, feel free to say it. And let your boy Hollywood know, man. I'm all ears, man. All ears and eyes are open. Listening and waiting for you guys to hit me up, man. So I'm just here, you guys. This is your boy Hollywood. I'm about to be gone. Enjoy the own foot. Peace out. Be safe.